a little bit later than I usually do because um, I uh, hit snooze one too many times this morning and by one too many times, I mean 40, 47. I hit snooze 47 times. But whether I wake up late or early, that does not change the fact that today is a film day and I thought of an idea where I am going to be separating my foods for an entire day. Which may sound a bit confusing, so I'm gonna explain it. I, I mean, the last time I heard the word separated was when my parents got a... <laughs> Okay, let's change this. Let's change the subject, Derek. Positive vibes. So because I am running a little bit late, the first thing I did today was ask for your guys' help on my Instagram story, which I like to do when I don't. Where's the clip? The clip is supposed to pop up with a little ding noise. You no, know maybe my editor's just having a hard day today. You understand? Everybody has those days where they're a little bit lazy. That's completely fine. But next time, you know, if you better not be lazy, otherwise you're gonna get fired. I'm gonna take your family that I have hidden in my basement. So what I did is I posted a video on my Instagram story of me asking you guys what I should be eating for each meal And that is going to be deciding what I am separating and of course if you guys aren't following me yet Be sure to go to at Derek underscore Gerard and follow the editor is still not doing anything If you're not yet following me on Instagram be sure to follow me at Derek underscore Gerard The uh, link will be in the description this video idea is a little bit confusing itself So instead of tell you guys what it is I thought I would show you with our first meal breakfast and the suggestion is coming from Daniel Raj 12 who says we should get a Tim Hortons donut and a coffee. So here we go with today's video. That's where I usually tell Okay, editor, this is just no, this isn't okay. What are you doing? Dude. Wait, what does that say? You're on vacation. Usually for me, this is great to the power of my editor. He would usually teleport me right, literally right here with the food. The camera's right here and I would say, okay guys, welcome to the, but I, I gotta go do it myself. Eric, your, your dad might be on some new levels of grumpy today where I gotta go, I gotta go and drive to Tim Hortons, go through the drive. Okay, I guess we're doing without an editor today, Herc. Well, I guess I have you. That's all I need. I have the D Squad. Let's do this video. I'm really good at faking my positivity lately. You see, now I was gonna go and drive and get the Tim Hortons, but I totally forgot that there's a Tim Hortons in the lobby of my apartment. Hi, can I just please get a coffee and a donut? Yeah, I know. I've been working on my sexiness. Just like that, we have our coffee and our donut. Just like the person on Instagram said, I actually didn't go and drive and get it. You know why? I was on my way to drive and get a coffee when um I ran... I ran out of gas. As you can see, I am panicking here. I had to pull over on the side of the busy street uh, because... I wasn't expecting to drive today. Usually I'm just teleporting all over the place in these videos not having to use gas. So on my way to Tim Hortons, I basically had to sit on the side of the road and wait for my mom to come and deliver me some gas so that I could eventually put it into my car and I could go and drive and get this darn coffee and donut and let's start, and let's, okay, it's time to finally explain this video. I consider meals to be like a symphony. I'm not the type of person who will eat their burger and then eat their fries and then drink their drink. I'm the type of person that takes a bite of their burger, a little bit of the fries, a little bit of the drink, and is continuously flowing through all the different items because when you mix them all together, it t it's just like magical, just like, whoa. whoa. Why was that my first instinct? But today there's gonna be no flowing because we are separating all the ingredients. For example, my coffee would usually have cream and sugar inside of it. But today, since we're filming this video, I have here the sugar that was gonna go inside of it and the cream. And I have to finish each separate ingredient before moving on to the next one. And we have our delicious looking donut over here, but this is probably gonna take a little bit more uh, preparation just because the donut has a lot of different parts. So the first thing is the chocolate caramel mixture on the top. Top. That is its very own ingredient, so we're gonna have to just remove that from the donut. All right, so there is part of the <laughs> just the top of the donut. So now you guys can see we have completely separated the icing from the donut, but we still have the caramel filling, which is its own ingredient. We're gonna open that up, and we're gonna have to scoop out. <laughs> oh my god! This is all the filling. This is it. That right there is the entire amount of filling taken from a Tim Hortons donut, and I scraped the sides of this thing, guys. It's 
freaking empty. Oh my god, that looks disgusting. So we have taken the two items we had for breakfast and turned it into six with today's challenge. We have our black Tim Hortons coffee, the sugar and the cream that was going to go inside of it. We have just the straight up icing from our donut, the sad amount of caramel that was inside of it, and the hollowed out cake from the donut. Let's eat. So if anybody out there wants to do this challenge, you need to know that you have to finish each ingredient. You can't take a sip of some of your coffee, then chug a creamer, and then throw some sugar. No, you have to finish each one. So I'm gonna start with just the spoonful of caramel that was inside the donut. That is honestly very surprising for some reason. It's just so incredibly sweet, like not sugary. Like it tastes artificial. Maybe if that was inside the donut, I wouldn't have noticed it. This is how much sugar I usually put into my coffee. Yeah, and now I'm putting it straight into my mouth. <coughs> when that's mixed, <coughs> when that's mixed into the coffee, it's completely tolerable. But when you do, don't try that at home. Next, I think we should just eat the straight up icing topping from the donut. Okay, at first I was kind of skeptical putting this into my mouth. I've, that's like the 20th time I've said that in the past week. Got chocolate chunks, caramel, and chocolate sauce. It is so good. Now, I was gonna pretend like I was super scared to drink these, but when I was a kid, this is one of my favorite things to do, just drink straight up creamers. Oh, it's still so good! Okay, this one's gonna be fine. This is just basically a cake part of a donut from Tim Hortons. The really weird thing is right now that I feel like I've consumed so much sugar, like my teeth feel like they're rotting, but on a normal day, I would com I would eat this and feel completely fine. A nice change from all the sugar is gonna be the black coffee I have right here, and that is going to do it for our breakfast. Shh, okay. Truth is, I'm not actually on vacation. I just got sick of editing for someone who doesn't keep their promises. Derek said he was gonna go to Japan, okay? You guys got the likes, but maybe he needs a little reminder. Take that like button down below, okay? Let's get this video to as many likes as possible to remind Derek he has to go to Japan, make a bunch of food videos like he promised. Okay, I'm going back on vacation, which is me just hiding under the table, so I don't have to edit. Okay, love you guys, bye! All right, you guys, so I'm now back in my car. Even after my super traumatic event, you know, where I should be suffering from PTSD, I I should be scared. I should not conquer it. But you know what? I was top. And yes, it is very dark, but I'm just sat in my parking garage right now. I guarantee it's not nighttime, but it is time for lunch. So just like I did for breakfast, I went over to my Instagram replies to see what you guys wanted me to get for my meal for lunch. And one of them stuck out to me. And that one was from Tassie underscore Supreme 12. And they said I should get Wendy's. That is what I'm going to be doing for lunch. One of the things I miss most, well, if you guys don't know, outside of videos, I'm completely vegetarian. I do not eat me. And even though I'm gonna have to separate it and eat each ingredient by itself, I'm still pumped to get my classic Wendy's order, which is a double cheeseburger, fries, some honey mustard, and just a nice Coke. All right, so I just got back from going inside to Wendy's to get my order. As you can see, there's my cute little face inside of the Wendy's, and I got my special order, the fries, the drink, the burger. I am stoked. Of course, we have to eat each ingredient by ingredient, so let's lift off the bun, and let's start. Oh, gosh, am I gonna, I'm gonna have to lick the damn Okay, first thing we're gonna eat right here is the pickles because those are on the very top, so let's do that. Luckily, in my day-to-day -day life, I love pickles. I have two jars of pickles in my fridge that in the middle of the night when I wake up and I need something quickly, I, I eat at like three o'clock in the morning almost every single night. There's nothing like watching the sun come up while sucking on a pickle, am I right? I said pickle. Right, yeah, I said pick. Next we have the ketchup and the mayo that's on the bun, and that's its own ingredient, so I'm gonna have to lick that off. Here we go. So we got some clean buns. That makes one of us. <laughs> I got a dirty little ass. I am going to save that for later, and the next thing on our burger are the onions. My mom is East Indian, so growing up, there was a lot of onions in our cooking, and also my mom can legit eat onion like it's an apple. Like, she'll take an onion with her dinner and straight up just take a nice, juicy bite out of it. It is disgusting. Nice, we got a nice, juicy 
juicy tomato. I feel like there are a lot of people who are like me where I can handle tomato when it's in something. Like, you know, on a pizza, in a burger, that's fine. But by its, no, not by itself. Next we have the, the lettuce, which is very sad looking. Let's just eat, we have to eat it all separately. Next here we have the cheese, which has problematically melted into the, I have to just scrape. Oh, this is gross. I didn't wash my hands. I've been touching the car. Here's our cheese. Now there's cheese. Oh, that's ow! Hey, yeah, yeah, yeah! All right, next up we have two beef patties with Derek's finger grease and just scraped a little bit of cheese. Oh, God, this is uh, this. I don't. Do this have some dent. I forget how to speak English all the time. Let's see how these are gonna taste. If there was any place where I would just have to eat the meat off of the burger, I'm glad it's Wendy's. All right, let's finish off this meat because I'm more excited for the bread. Because if you guys know me and you've watched my videos, you know I love just eating straight up bread. So I'm super pumped to eat these buns. Okay, I'm not talking about eating the boot. All right, so let's grab our bun from over there. Let's put it on there, and we have the last part of our burger. All right, time for our drink. Let's just grab our spoon right here. And I know you guys are probably wondering, Derek, why are you grabbing a spoon for your drink? We're gonna be eating the ice and then drinking our drink. So let's uh, let's do, let's do this. Oh, oh, I really used this. <laughs> I'm ah, ah, ah. Let's get that and now let's enjoy our drink. And the last thing I really need is some Wendy's fries dipped in Wendy's honey honey mustard. Where the Where are my fries? I asked for a combo with fries and they gave me Wendy's chili. How many damn ingredients are in this chili? And how am I supposed to even sep- This video is going so well! Wendy, I'm not mad, I'm just- I'm just disappointed, okay? You know what? No, I am mad. Yes, I am mad. You know why? Because it took me damn near an hour to separate all of these ingredients. This chili has all of this stuff. It's all mixed together, crammed together. The colors are all the same, so it's so hard to tell. <gasps> I'm sorry, I'm supposed to be a good role model. Can I guess? Yes, I love you. You know, a lot of people will say, Derek, it's so gross that you let Herc lick your mouth, but like, he's my son. Now that I think about it, if I saw a dad letting his son lick his face on the side of this, I would probably call the police, so let's not use that analogy. All right, so let's eat and go over these ingredients. I don't want to waste any more time on this. The first ingredient is the ground beef inside the chili. I mean, it's fine. It's extremely cold because it took me so long to separate all these ingredients. I'm sure it's going to be better then what- I don't even know what these are. Inside the chili there were these like green little things that looked like peppers or celery, but I have to eat them because it is one of the ingredients inside of this chili. Okay, that tasted like um... Like Wendy hawked a loogie into the chili before they gave it to me. Next we have literally five kidney beans in the entire bowl of chili. There were five of these. Ingredient number 72, we have a nice helping of pinto beans. To finish it off here, we have the tomato sauce, which is the main part of the chili. Okay, so I have been looking at Instagram and you guys have been giving me ideas for what I should eat But I think what I'm gonna do now for the rest of the day is pick items that don't have a lot of ingredients After having to deal with that chili for the past hour having to pick individual ingredients and sort them I never want to deal with that Ever again so was, How do you someone get into the build? Hold on, hold on Should not be here right now. Anyways, don't well. I mean, you know why? Because your daddy posted something on Instagram today, and he said he needed some food. So what I did was got you some. Oh, you're ready, camera? You're already filming? Hey, Herc, sick him. Herc, get him. Oh. Get him. Get him, Herc. Get him. He's not gonna get me. I know you're really hungry. You need something really like to fill you up. I got so much stuff on there for you. I loaded this thing to the max, dude. You are gonna love. It. Look, feel it. Feel it heavy. This is a pound. I guarantee this is a pound. Wait. So why? Why? Why did you think I was hungry? Why did you go to sub? You said on your story that you were like really hungry. No, no, that's for another dessert. That's for dessert later on. <sighs> Do you know what I'm filming today, Jasper? Some food challenge, probably. Get over here! What am I doing? You don't understand what I'm- I'm gonna hit her! I'm gonna get some bowls now. I got- Oh, this perfect amount right here. Wait, what? Got, oh you... my god! <laughs> Alright, first ingredient. Turkey. Put that in one of theirs. Good, good thing you got two, because you're gonna be eating this with me, okay? Okay, you know what? I feel really bad now. 
No, you don't. No, I no don't. you don't. I'm actually glad. All right, so um, fast, we'll fast forward in around an hour and a half when I finish separating all these damn ingredients. This gonna take forever. Wait, why are you? You don't need to do that. Just snap your fingers and we can next teleport into the future. My editor's on break today. Okay, I've, I've, I've had to actually do everything for once today. Wait, what? What? Your editor? Well, you're the editor. Yeah, but they don't know that. Okay, after a long process. I'm taking all of the toppings off these damn Subway subs. I have made Jazz Ball stay here with me so he can deal with what I've been dealing with for the old the, the morning was great! The morning was great! And now... I mean, oh wow, because now I'm here, the morning isn't great? It's not the morning anymore! Bread first. Okay. What are you doing? Putting the ingredients in. You had to eat, we had to eat everything separately. That's the, that's the theme of the video. First thing is the bread. Let's eat the bread. Go on. How's the next video going? Do you really care? <laughs> Bread is complete. Now we're gonna pick each pick an ingredient. Um, they really skimped out on the jalapenos at Subway. They literally there was like seven in the Look for jalapenos! Huh? Look for jalapenos, not jalapenos. Buenos nachos, okay? Buenos nachos. Don't even bring nacho in the bueno! I don't understand. Eat. You just put everything up. So if I were to eat your drink, which I was probably gonna eat chocolate milk, you're gonna separate the chocolate from the milk? Yes! How the hell are you gonna do that? You don't wanna know. Yeah. Let's just say I'm bringing the ancients back, okay? No! Let's, I don't want to take the- You can have the, the jalapenos, because uh, you really- I can have it! You can have jalapeno! I'm already spiced it now, I can have it! <laughs> Alright, so you got two down. I can have jalapeno! Rock, paper, scissors. Ha ha! Baby! Rock beats scissors. Why do I always do scissors? I don't know why you didn't get any sauce. Gary, I'm really scared. Can I have some milk or something? No. You didn't get any milk! I have to get it straight from the source then. Ew! I think the one thing that Subway does really well are their cucumbers. Though. Cucumbers are done! Oh no, it actually hurts. I'm sweating, I'm getting red. You- <laughs> What do you mean? Did you eat any of them yet? You want some lettuce? That's what, that's what you get for walking into Dare Gerard's apartment on a film day. It's okay, buddy. I never know when it's a film day or not. It's always a film day if you're walking in. <laughs> they have the M&M cookies broken into the M&Ms and the actual cookie, so we'll save that for last. I didn't save that for last. If we're already messing everything else, I'm already messed that up too. Fine. So I'm gonna eat this cheese right here. Try some of this. Uh, tell me that the sub doesn't disguise how disgusting this cheese is. It's, the texture is so weird. Eating skin. Yeah, it's like an old man's force. It's like an old man's skin. I haven't got my lettuce yet. There's a lot of lettuces here. I don't really have tomatoes by themselves, so I really don't know if this is good or not. Based on like tomatoes. I don't think I like tomatoes. Turkey is complete. Tomatoes are complete. Take those cookies with you and get out. Take the cookies with you! You're gonna make me yell at you in front of my son? Look at him, just look at him, he's so distressed right now. He's your son, Derek, he's my godson. Yeah, he's your godson. Yeah, so who has more seniority, huh? What's his middle name? What is, what is Hercules' middle name? Yeah. Bartholomew. F*** how did you know? I appreciate you bringing me food, but it's like the one time you do it is on the worst time. I didn't mean to, okay? I just try to be a good friend. I know, that's the thing. You try, try, but you fail, and you fail, and you fail. Actions can save friendships, and that's what I'm gonna do. What? Yeah. I'm gonna make this up, dude. No, you don't need to. Please don't. When you least expect it. Oh, jeez. Alright, I'm just gonna... Over here, and I'm going to... No, 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 why, why, why are you here? What is the point of this? I know you hate me, you don't want to talk to me, you don't want to see me anymore, you know, you don't want to touch me anymore. Oh my... But Can you stop making a joke out of all... Which is why I brought you this. A pizza. I wanted to make up for it. You're making up for what? For bringing I me to want, Subway? Tell so you'll like it. After that Subway with a million bajillion okay. ingredients, I don't I don't know if I'm gonna love it anymore. You will. You will. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I didn't mean it, all right? I'll, I'll leave. I'm done. I'll You're leave. leaving? Hey, please. Just take it. Take it, dude. Okay, so you understand that there better not be a lot of things on that pizza. I'm gonna finish off my video. I appreciate you dropping it off. Thank, thank you for the pizza, buddy. Thank you. See, this is why my relationship with Jazz Paul is so up and down. Like, this is a nice gesture. A friend brings over a pizza for me. Like, any other time, this would be wonderful. I am just deathly afraid to open this box right now. He said he understood the video that I was filming, and he did this out of the kindness of his heart. So there should be next to nothing on this pizza. And there is... What the hell? 
jazz party. Are you kidding me? <laughs> oh. Whoa, is it? Is everything okay out there? You know what, I don't have an editor today. There's nobody teleporting me places. I'm doing everything on my own. So what's stopping me from just taking a bite of this pizza and enjoying it in its full form? If I'm the person who's doing everything, doesn't that mean that I get to make the rules? Yeah, yes, you know what, it does. So the new rule is that the challenge is over and I'm gonna enjoy this pizza. Emergency mm. backup alarm activated. Initiating cheater submission system. No, 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 please. <laughs> All right, so now I am sat here with this pizza and for the next hour, maybe two hours, I'm gonna have to meticulously take off every single condiment, organize them and eat every ingredient. Why can't I just snap my fingers like I always do in videos, you know, just snap my fingers and it'll all be done. Why can't that just happen? I just wanna just snap, just come on! Whoa! Oh my God, it worked! Wait. Yes, Derek, I am back from vacation. Yes, yes I am. Yes. Yes. Okay, does this mean for the final meal, okay, just listen to me, that we can do an epic montage, finish off this video, and I will destroy this pizza right now. Let's do it, baby. Everything and I am going to complete this challenge with my last thing for the day my single ingredient water Thank you so much to every single person who has made it to this point in the video I truly 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 appreciate it whether you're subscribed or you're not whether you like the video or you did not I am just glad that you stuck around to the very end we could share a couple laughs and I, I, I Honestly, it means the world to me. I will see you all in my next video whether it be a food challenge or, or probably it'll probably be a food challenge just be sure to always remember the motto of do good, die great, and have a fantastic day. All right, see you guys. Bye! And I came across this section right here, and one of them stuck out to me, and that one was this. F I dropped the wrong. God damn it. This is so hard!